Hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Jana. Thank you so much for stopping by and taking the time out of your day to watch this video. I would really appreciate it if you liked and subscribed down below if you want. I post every single Tuesdays and sometimes on Saturdays. So today's video is going to be a comparison between the Louis Vuitton Rosalie coin purse and the Louis Vuitton Enfront key pouch in the black uh, leather. <laughs> so I've had this Empreinte for three years now, like October of 2017, and I finally got the Rosalie coin purse. And I thought I'd do a comparison between these two because they are very, very similar. And when I first wanted to get this one, I was debating between this or this. So let's actually start with the Rosalie coin purse first. So this is 4.3 inches by 3.1 by one, around one inch in depth. This one is the monogram. It is one piece of canvas that wraps around with the rose ballerine interior. So it also comes in different colors and canvases, so be sure to check the website for more information. It is grained cowhide leather with the leather trim, so all this pink part is leather and just this monogram part is canvas. So it has the gold hardware and also a leather button closure. And then it has a main compartment. It has two, oops, it has two credit card slots, one at the front, one at the back. It has a slip pocket at the back and also a zippered compartment at the front. Now moving on to the Empreinte Clay or key pouch. This is 5.3 inches by 2.7 inches by with the gusset part is 0 0.5 inches and then obviously this doesn't have the gusset so this one only comes in two colors the black and the marine rouge which is the navy blue with the red piping on the side this one is monogram on prawns embossed supple green cowhide leather it has the cowhide leather lining. It has gold hardware with the snap button closure and the zipper at the back. And then it has the gold chain with the hook and just one main open compartment. I like that if I finally have a traditional wallet option and I don't have to use the Empreinte as a like a supplement. And now that I have both of them, I can rotate both of them into my collection. I've used this ever since I've got it every single day basically for two years. So now that I have this, it is awesome to just give this a little bit of a break. I love that it has a separate compartment for the coins because I do you or I do end up putting coins in here. I have no problem with it being dirty or anything. Um, I can just wipe it down. But honestly, when I put coins in here, I haven't had to like wipe it or anything. Although it is black, so obviously you can't really see the coin residue or anything. But still, I love that this one has the separate compartment for coins. I also love that there are two slip pockets for designated cards. I absolutely love like card slots. I also love this like back compartment. You can put some more cards in there. And then this main compartment, obviously you can put some more cards in here. So for the cons, the leather button is a like a major concern for a lot of people. And for me, I really like the leather button because it matches the interior of the um, color you chose. So obviously, this leather button is going to get damaged and will have color transfer on it or like some scratches and everything, but that's just the nature of having a wallet. You know, you can't prevent everything that's going to happen with your bags or your wallets. Like, that's just not gonna happen, you know? So my last con is this 
front zip compartment. Now I do like a separate compartment for coins, which is awesome, but I've noticed that if you do put a lot of coins in here, you won't be able to shut it closed because it just like bulges up like this and it would be harder to button up. So having like a back compartment would be great, just like the clay. This one has the back compartment and yeah so that's my only complaint about this rosalie coin purse okay moving on to the omfront pros list so obviously it is meant to be a key pouch i have tried to put my keys in here actually and like i don't have that many keys i have my car fob and that's basically all i need but because i use this as a compact wallet this chain sometimes gets in the way so i actually have a method of putting the chain out of the way so that it doesn't like bother you have this all the way up like this and then let it go like this and then kind of turn it this way and then it will be straight up like that another pro that i have is like it's leather i love leather stuff especially because of this like grainy material um there's no like scratches it doesn't show any signs of wear especially on the leather and i love that the coin compartment is on the outside like i said with the rosalie if it's on the front it's kind of harder to close the wallet if you have more coins for the cons like i said the chain can be very annoying but if you use that method or if you do that it will be out of the way so why did I get both? Why do I have both? Um, so like I said at the beginning of the video, I was contemplating between these two when I first got this. I decided to get the Empreinte first. Why did I decide to get the Empreinte first versus the Rosalie? It is because it is a neutral color and it is very, very subtle. I was still in school and I didn't want to draw attention to the items that I had. When I'm starting my luxury collection, I want it to be as neutral as possible just so everything kind of matches with each other. But now that I do have neutral colors in my luxury collection, I want to start incorporating my favorite color which is the baby pink color. Why did I still want the Rosalie when I already had the empreinte right so it's the style and this is more of a compact wallet than this one when i first saw this three years ago obviously it's gone through price increases but i rather have the price increases than buying these two at the same time and regretting my purchase because i've used this for so so long now i am ready to step it up so I wanted to purchase this. So we're gonna start with the Empreinte because I've had this for longer. Oh, also I forgot to mention that the Empreinte, because it is leather, it will stretch out the more you put your cards in it. I have this many coins to show you. And these are, so I'm Canadian by the way, so I also I have Canadian bills and I also have a American bill. So because I'm trying to incorporate um, American bills because a lot of you guys who watch my videos are American, want it to be as broad of a spectrum as possible. I'm sorry I don't have euros or anything else, but if I did, I would definitely incorporate it, but sorry I do not. So let's just put all these coins. Well, I have 12 cards here at 14 if you count these two, but we're not going to do that uh, because it's going to stretch. So that obviously has no problem getting in there. I have two of my Canadian bills and I just put that at the back and then obviously an American bill. So that is how that looks like and there it is it is very heavy obviously but it fits in here i will never ever put this many cards in here <laughs> because it is very packed so i'll take out 
four cards and that's already so much better this is more comfortable for me but if you want to stuff it by all means stuff it let's move on to the rosalie and i'm gonna put exactly the same amount of cards coins and cash in here so here are the coins one in that slip pocket one in the other slip pocket and there's also a slip pocket at the back so i am just gonna put two cards in here because if you put more this back pocket will start to bulge out and that's not cute and then the rest of the cards here and then my three fills that i have and i'm just gonna put that right in the middle as well yeah that ain't closing that is not closing like look at that so this one fits more because it is leather and it stretches out so we're gonna take a bunch of cards out we're gonna take four cards out a few coins and three bills and that fits way better so it still fits a lot so that's how it looks like now all right so this is the overview of what i just talked about so i have both of them right here so you can fit a maximum of 12 cards here and and then all of this fits into both of them and then over on this side you can fit a maximum of eight cards in the rosalie this stuff fits in here and then this stuff fits into there so Hopefully this makes it a little bit easier to uh, focus on and kind of recollect your thoughts if you were thinking about one of these two. So which one would you rather have? Would you rather have the Rosalie coin purse or the Empreinte clay? So let me know if you have both, which colors do you have or if you have either, which one would you get first? If you have any other questions, make sure to leave them down below or message me on instagram if you want i will try to get back to you as usual thank you so much for watching hopefully this video helped you a little tiny bit and i hope i see you next time bye